Hey friends, today we're diving into something seriously powerful and exciting. Ever wondered how Iran protects its skies with precision and power? We've got a missile that intercepts anything flying too close. Boom, gone. Don't underestimate the Sayyad 4, it's got some wild capabilities to show. This missile is proudly Iranian, homegrown tech, defense, and innovation. It's fast, it's accurate, and it's got impressive reach, too. We're gonna unpack it step by step, no jargon, just straight talk, from its backstory to how it compares with the world's best. Let's kick things off with the Sayyad 4's technical specifications. It's a surface-to-air missile with nearly 300 kilometers of range, Built for long-range defense, it's designed to take down threats. Fighter jets, drones, cruise missiles, this beast hits them all. It can strike targets at altitudes up to 30 kilometers, and speed? We're talking Mach 6 to 8, insanely fast stuff. It's around 7 meters long and weighs close to 2 tons. It packs a fragmentation warhead that delivers a solid punch. The missile is stored in special launch containers, ready to fire. It launches vertically, so it can strike in any direction. Uses a hot launch method, engine ignites right in the tube. Each Bavar 373 launcher holds four of these powerhouses. Let's rewind and talk about how it all came to be. When Russia delayed Iran's S-300 delivery, Iran made a move. They said, we'll build our own, and they meant it seriously. Project started in 2010, full effort from day one. Fast forward a few years and boom, Sayyad 4 was introduced. It was designed by the Iranian army and built by the Ministry of Defense. First shown in a 2014 expo, but officially unveiled in 2019. That's when Bavar 373 went public, with Sayyad 4 at its core. This is the fourth generation in the Sayyad missile family. Earlier models, Sayyad 1, 2, and 3, led to this major leap. The focus was on extending range, precision, and jamming resistance. Sayyad 4 took things to a whole new operational level. In 2022, Sayyad 4B made its debut, a more powerful variant. Its range passed the 300-kilometer mark, going well beyond. Ceiling altitude also jumped from 27 to 32 kilometers. At that height, there's really no hiding from its reach. So what system is this missile built for exactly? Sayad 4 is made specifically for the Bavar 373 defense system. You won't find it used elsewhere. It's exclusive to that platform. Bavar 373 is Iran's top tier long range air defense system. The purpose? Full protection of Iran's airspace, no compromises. Whether it's a stealth jet, drone, or incoming cruise missile, Sayyad 4 reacts fast, locks on, and makes clean hits. It can operate even under intense electronic warfare conditions. It's been proven to detect and track stealth aircraft like F-35. Its vertical launchers can engage multiple targets simultaneously. Together with Bavar 373, it forms a serious sky shield network total area coverage and strategic reach in all directions. Though mainly for aerial threats, it's got anti-ballistic chops too. That means if a ballistic missile comes in, Sayyad 4 responds. Still, its main role is targeting aerodynamic aerial threats, but that bonus capability adds serious value to the system. Live tests have shown how capable this missile really is, in one trial, it hit a target over 300 kilometers away. Some reports even claim successful hits up to 350 kilometers. And yes, foreign defense sites took note it and reported it too. The radar setup is just as advanced, especially the Mirage 4 unit. With a detection range up to 450 kilometers, it's no joke. It can track dozens of targets and manage simultaneous strikes that's exactly what you need during swarm or saturation attacks. Sayad 4's guidance system is also a standout feature here. It uses inertial navigation, radio command, and active radar. If someone tries jamming it, it switches and keeps going. That flexibility is gold in modern battlefield conditions. 
Its engine uses thrust vector control, serious maneuverability here. At high altitudes, it adjusts course with pinpoint accuracy. Even agile, dodging targets won't shake it off. This gives it a global edge not many systems have. Each Bavar 373 unit has six launchers with four missiles each, so that's 24 Sayad 4s ready to go at any moment. It can fire at six to nine targets simultaneously, no problem. Perfect against coordinated, multi-pronged air assault. Now, let's stack it up against some global heavyweights. Compared to Russia's S-300 and America's Patriot, Sayad excels. Longer range, higher altitude, more simultaneous engagements, clear lead. Even its radars outperform older models in jamming resistance. Some say Sayad 4B is nearing S-400 territory. That's big. It can hit stealth targets just like top-tier global systems. Patriot? It locks on to one target. Sayad hits several at once. That scale of engagement is a huge strategic advantage. Honestly, for a homegrown defense system, that's massive progress. Iran has leapt ahead of many regional players with this. No neighbor has a comparable long-range shield at this scale. It's like putting a steel dome over the country's skies. In today's world, airspace is just as critical as borders. Without strong air defenses, you're vulnerable to modern attacks. Sayad 4 and Bavar 373 fix that gap big time. They can watch everything from low to high altitude threats. Oh, and did you know the name Sayad has real meaning? It honors a war hero, Ali Sayad Shirazi, a national figure. The missile's name represents courage, defense, and national pride. Every launch carries a message, don't mess with this sky. If you're enjoying this breakdown, don't forget to hit like. Got questions? Drop them in the comments, I'll answer everything. Have another system you're curious about? Let me know. We'll cover it here. Same chill vibe, same deep dive. So yeah, Sayad 4 isn't just a missile, it's a milestone, a leap towards stronger deterrence and a safer Iranian sky. It's built with science, sacrifice, and solid national vision. And that's how you keep your airspace truly untouchable.